Why am I the one being chased? Oh, yeah. I oh, hey, hey, hey. Welcome to my channel, everyone. I am the Global Cherry, and we will be continuing Mafia Definitive Edition. To be safe from the Mafia, subscribe, like the video, and share the video. I'm really excited to continue this game. We gotta get ready for a big day. For our boy to start racing. Oh, this is going to be good. Where's my popcorn? Ow. So Sam walks out of the bathroom, and I'm praying he's got a piece on him, because I'm not sure the bartender's going to hand over what he owes. And his two sons, they're inching closer. I can hear them cracking their knuckles. They're both seven feet tall, built like brick shit houses. Whoa. What were you carrying? Nice story. My dick. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. This crazy bastard, he waltzes out of the bathroom to start pissing all over the joint. <laughs> really? What, he didn't call the cops? Nah. Sometimes you just gotta make him think you're crazy. <laughs> Tom, you got the moments. Oh, wow. Jeffrey, as much as I like hearing that story, we're in a situation. Oh, yeah, it's nothing like that. Mikey Dunn, our driver. Some of Morello's guys roughed him up pretty good last night. Huh? Broke his arm, broke his jaw, sent him to the hospital. Jesus. Yeah. What are we going to do? Money. Anyway, you're going to race for him. Wait, sure. What? Wait, Frank, what? Tom, look. There's a half hour before the starting gun goes off, so this is not a discussion. The Don wants to win, but more importantly, he wants Morello to lose. And you are our best wheelman. You Otherwise, want me to race for I'll be talking you? Talking to someone else. Yeah. Okay, Frank. Good. Rafi has the car gassed and ready. Get to the track right away. <laughs> Polly and Sam are like, I don't know. You think he'll win? Maybe. From Europe, we got the hotshot favorite, Martin Lichtenberg, taking some time out of the internet. Martin Lichtenberg, my enemy. Got some news from the grid here. Lost heaven local favorite, Mikey Dunn, is out. Replacing him. Tommy! Uh, <laughs> he doesn't know who I am. Well, I'm sure you'll all join me in wishing him good luck. We made it! We're first place! After many tries. You will never know how many attempts I did this race. Hey, Tommy! There's <laughs> our winner! Yeah, Vincenzo! Hey, I just want to thank you for stepping in like you did. I had six months rent riding on that race. I'd be homeless now if not for you. Now you got some asked, money. Lucas. Well, you gotta let me find a way to repay you. Stop by my garage when you get a chance. I might have a line on something that'll turn a buck for you. Sure. Ooh. Thanks. Thank you, Lucas. I knew you wouldn't let us down, Tom. You made us all a lot of money today. And Morello's gonna be picking up pennies off the sidewalk for weeks. <laughs> hey, what about the European? He's probably wearing some Cheers. boots by now, the poor bastard. Ooh. Here. You earned every dollar of this. Take your girl out somewhere nice. Thanks, boss. You got a girl, right? I don't want you blowing all that on booze and whores. Nah, but uh, maybe I'll buy my ma a new coat. <laughs> Good boy. Go get yourself a drink. All cheers to that. Congratulations, big hero. Nah, I just got luckies off. Well, I had my money on the other guys, so drinks are on you. <laughs> oh. Oh, you were betting on the other guy, huh? <laughs> there. Now you're ready for the pictures. Thanks. Hey, oh, there's a group picture. You might want to go find your buddy Polly. He's so drunk, he's gonna get hit by a parked car. <laughs> yeah, okay. Polly will be fine. I'll get him home safe. Cow says moo, and the chicken says <laughs> What does the bird say? I don't know, but the security guy back there says you gotta go home. That's an asshole. You should show some respect! Well, that's true, but I'm saying you gotta go home too, before you resurface the pit lane. Good idea. Well, okay then. I guess. <laughs> Let's go. Yeah, you're definitely drunk. No, do I have to drive you? 
It's been a long day. I only have three shots. Don't throw up in the car. Let's get you back home. The bridge. Take the bridge over to the island. Take me to the ladies. I never knew the bridge is where the place. ladies are. Is that going to be Tommy's to girl? Them. You want anything else? One more bottle. I'm heading home. Hey, Tom, uh, before you go, I ask maybe a small favor. Huh? Is it illegal? What do you need? Walk my daughter home. Sarah, the way I hear it, she doesn't need any kind of escort. <laughs> she's, uh, she's a tough. This is a she's a tough back girl. Of boys who need her place. Uh, the punks, you know, Cativira guys. They, they talk blue, make advances. So you want me to protect Sarah? Sarah. She's gonna speak at the mind. Or maybe she says a something they don't like. Things that get ugly. But if you work in at home, this is a reminder of this punk, she's the dawn's a goddaughter. Okay. No problem, Luigi. I'd be honored. I'd be honored. Benny. Sarah, time is to close. Benny, let's walk Sarah. And maybe teach some punk some lesson. What's this then? Uh, Tom is, uh, Tom's gonna take you. That right. Hey, I just work here. Make sure nobody bother you. Fine. If it'll make you feel better, Pop. Hey. I'll see you tomorrow. Let me get my coat. I'll wait for you outside. Is it a date? Oh, hey there, Why do you darling? look like one of those people from you Greece? You out on us? Piss off. <laughs> Don't cast the kitten doll face. We'll let your boyfriend watch. What do you say? We going to have trouble here? Oh, that's trouble not a way to treat a lady. To steal our girl, chief. You saps aren't careful. You'll end up in wooden overcoats. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Last chance to walk away. We ain't frails. We know who you work for. Salieri might have been the big six when he was younger, but he's all washed up now. Mm -hmm. It's only a matter of time before Morello punches his ticket. <laughs> don't you don't want to mess with me. Or anyone else. Not for this. <laughs> well, you this <laughs> then let's see what you got, cake eater. Mm. Oh, let's see what, what you, you got. Her, sweet cheeks? Uh, Back off. Uh, <laughs> Ah! There's some kind of dish, ain't ya? Get away from me! Hey. Twist like you's waist. Hey! Hey, Johnny here. We can do this all day. Oh, one of them's gone. Oh! Hey! Hey! That's for harassing a girl. Oh, oh, ow, ow. Oh, he had a knife on him. Oh, that was a bit aggressive, bud. Get away. Ha! Ooh, that's gotta hurt. Tommy! Oh no, don't touch her. Oh, you're a big guy, aren't you? My turn now. Your you're turn? Better than your friends. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> Ow. I'm not used to this. That's what I got, you son of a bitch. I'll show you who's the real man. Yes, go you go, girl. I'll give you that. You're bleeding. 
Come up to my place. I'll take a look. Oh, so this is Sarah's apartment. I'm wondering when you'd invite me up. And that's how they got together. Thanks, clothes slugger. I'm just gonna patch you up is all. Now go sit down on the couch, roll up your sleeve. I'm getting my sewing kit. Oh, dang, look at that wound. Doesn't look too bad. You need something for the pain? No, I'm fine. You don't have to do that. What? I can I'm see fine. It hurts, Tom. You want to pretend it don't go ask Polly to staple you up. What do you Polly actually uses staples to stitch people? Compliments of the Dan. <laughs> Sharing is caring. Take another. It'll ease the pain, bud. All right. You're gonna grin and bear this? Yes. Okay. No. Good. Yes. Cause I don't need the little old lady next door complaining at the super about all the racket. Just be quick about it, will ya? Oh, it's gonna take as long as it takes. The sloppier the stitch, the uglier the scar. These You're were the right. battle scars I got. You stitched up a lot of fellas. Just my father. Mm. Ma would really go after Luigi sometimes. He got pretty good at ducking dinner plates. So one day she stabbed him with her knitting needle. Oh, her why? Hand. That's a dysfunctional family. Because she was an ugly, jealous drunk. Oh. There. Not my best work, but it'll hold. The scar will be something to remember you by, if nothing else. That's a sentimental way of thinking about it. Have you stumbling through the neighborhood, pie-eyed? Not when them hoods are out looking for you, anyways. Yeah, okay. You got an extra blanket or something? No. And the heat's out. You're going to inch closer, aren't you? Yep. Myself, though. Aww. I don't have a daughter of my own, Tom. I'd do anything for Luigi's little girl. We look after so family. We, we all would. That's right, boss. Anything for Luigi and Sarah. Do those we would do anything for Luigi, you know? Something? I'll rip them apart with my own hands. Oh, dang, Polly. Our business is protection. But who's gonna pay up when they learn we can't even protect one of our own as she walks home from work? So what do you want us to do? Oh, some Teach revenge these happening. Boys a lesson. Break every bone in their bodies, put them in wheelchairs, bust their faces up so bad even their mothers can't look at them without screaming. <laughs> you know where hold up? My friend on the force says we should start looking into Chinatown. They okay, let's look around Chinatown. Stuff. Tommy, go to Vinny, get us some gear. Meet me at Biff's place. Yeah, okay. Uncle Vin has some stuff to street. provide us. I want everyone to know we do not allow mad dogs to run wild in our neighborhood. Mad Get dogs can't run around our neighborhood. We bark back. Uncle Vin, you got some weapons for me? Oh, he's pouring himself a drink. Hey, hey. here for some heaters, Tom. Nah, I'm already going and healed. Paulie and me, we gotta give a beating to some punks who've been on our turf. I don't wanna pull this and piss in our own street. There's something to bust heads. That's all we need. You know, something that makes the head go... <laughs> Sam turned over some guy's warehouse and, uh... We got some more bats. I Babe Ruth himself, the guy said. I mean, it's horse shit, but they bust heads. They bust I heads. Have time for questions. That's all that matters. Not at all. Thanks, Vinny. Thanks, Vinny. Now that I got some Babe Ruth bats, time to go bust some heads. We're driving around Chicago, heading towards Chinatown. 
That's definitely not the way to park. There you are, Polly. About time. Come on, I'm wet through. Why Biff moved into this dump, I'll never know. Give him a break. He's in love. With the city or the people in it? A pawn shop, huh? Biff, you fat bastard. How you doing? How you doing, Biff? I don't understand. Starface, great to see you. Call her off, Biff. We got business. Upstairs, please. So, what's the beef? Need some information. Got some jokers causing trouble. They mess with Luigi's daughter. And we need them to pay. Time. You got any more? One of them's a weasel named Billy. Pals with a prissy chump and a bruiser with a bald head. Right, right, I know them. They're set up in the old service station a block over. They hock some gear every now and then, in small time. The old service That's station? Why I to come to you, Biff. You're good with small time. You know how to deal with time that is small. You'll find them there. Thanks. See you around. See you around. Uh, about that dough? Give me a moment, Polly, to read some comics. Tell me hey, boys. Seen in my life. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what a bunch of perverts. Billy, the guy from the other night. We gotta go. <laughs> <laughs> how dare you touch my girl? Go get him! Nice. Ha! Ah! Yeah! I need to teach you a lesson! Ha! Yeah! How dare you harass a lady! Yeah! Ah! Home run, baby! Ooh, that's gotta hurt. Just me and you! Oh, you missed, buddy! Yeah! Ooh, that's gotta give you more than a concussion, bud. We gotta teach them not to harass women. Oh, let me climb the ladder. Hey! I caused an explosion. Waha! Oh, he was in a lot of pain already. Whoa, look at that electricity. Ah, oh, crap. I got shot. Oh, it hurts. Oh, no. Oh, hey. This is so epic. I love it. He's down. Oh, yeah, you're definitely on fire, all right. Oh. Oh, oh god. It's that guy again. <laughs> That's all of them. Ha! Put him in the ground. Oh, we hunted you down, all right. Ha! Oh, they got backup. Polly, where are you going? Ow! Polly, I thought it was safe. Oh! Oh! Where are you going? Oh, ow! Oh gosh, my health! I forgot how invulnerable I am, ow! We gotta catch up with Billy! Hey! Johnny, get down! Oh, come on, come on. Get out of here. oh, they're getting out of here. We need to chase them. I just wanted to have a smoke, man. Come on, we can't lose them. Let's go. They ain't seen you drive like I have. Polly, you believe in me too much. And I mean too much. I think I'm damaging Polly as this is happening. Dumb son of a bitch just wrecked himself. <laughs> well, they're not Get wrecked, sucker. Oh, they died? I wanna pop him, Tom. Pop the noggin. 
Non. Non, non, oui. Oui. Oui, ça va. Fucking die, man. Oh, stop. You can't feel sorry for these animals. I like this would plug you if you give him the chance. He didn't know what life he was walking into. Yes, I'm out. This one's finished too. You have to pop him twice. Hmm. <sighs> Having a smoke after a murder. Oh. oh Christ, Tom. Snap out of it. You remember what those guys wanted to do to Sarah? Yeah. Yeah. Just uh Hey. Let's get out of here before the bulls show up, huh? They're calling cops bulls now. Are we gambling? Simple straight. Oh, was it poker? Oh. Polly he lost. I can't afford this life no more. Just getting lucky. I'll give you a chance to win your money back. The debt's growing you bigger and boss? bigger. We have business to discuss, Polly. We're in it now, boys. One of our What's going on? The coroner's office sent this over. Corpse's name is Giolotti. Oh, was it the same him? guy? Sure. That just One died? We ran out of the neighborhood. Now we got the bullet in the back of his head? Yeah. We capped him. Well, the cops ought to thank us. We did him a favor. The guy was a rapist, boss. Yeah? Well, he was also a city councilor's son. Oh. You drive a politician into Morella's arms? There's no better way than killing off his family. Oh, so there could I be an worse. issue then. You left another guy in the wreck? Yeah, but... He was dead when we got there. You gonna tell me he was the president's nephew or something? <laughs> Two in the head, Paulie. If you're gonna do a job, do it right. He made it? Yes. He spent the week in St. Mary's, but he pulled through. He survived? Can he point a finger at Oh, you? they're in big trouble then. Know. Maybe. Okay. What are we going to do, Polly? Look. We're gonna kill two birds with one blast. How? Galati's funeral's today at St. Michael's. Sam? You're going to attend. Sit in the back and try to spot the lucky bastard. How will I recognize him? He'll be the one who just crawled away from a car wreck. His Duh. Arm Look for a sling. Look for an Sam's injured gonna man a at a funeral. If he's going to clean up your mess. Are you sending Tommy to dip his wick? It's a brothel? A gentleman's club, just down the street from St. Michael's. A the brothel? Has invested a lot of money in it over the years. So me and Sam. Regardless, the owner has suddenly decided to do business with Morello instead of us. You want me to go remind him of his obligations? Yes. Then blow the place up. Oh. What? Blow it Morello up? Morello wants to take businesses away from us? He'll inherit craters. We're oh, committing Tom. terrorism we can't now? Polly and Sam since all the ladies know them already. They'd never make it through the front door. But you can walk right in. Because they don't know him yet. Okay. What about the manager? Take care of him wherever you find him. If any of the horse see it, well, it'll be a warning. Once he's out of the way, head to his office on the top floor. Grab any documents and money you find there and place the explosives. Vincenzo will see that you have what you need. So make sure the hotel be goes... To give me cover. Yeah, but be smart. Only take a shot if you know you won't get me. Tommy, one more thing. One of the girls is passing Morello information about our operations. One of the girls at the Before brothel? You the place, you'll need to take care of her, too. Kill her? You want Tommy to kill a twist? Come on, Frank. It's just bad luck this falls to Tom. But we gotta protect the family. Her name is Michelle. She's usually working one of the upper rooms. Her photo is in the folder. So they want me to kill you the... Clear on everything? Girls. Oh, so her. Yeah. Tom. Tom has to make a lot of done. tough decisions today. Heard you in the market for something that goes boom. Yeah, something that goes boom and dynamite stick, eh? You don't have to rub her out. Just make her disappear. You oh, does her. Sam like yeah. this girl? 
I've been with her a few times. Oh. She's a good egg, Tom. Just maybe not so bright. Hello. You behave yourself in here, okay? Jeez. You behave yourself, bud. Are you the manager? Yeah, head straight through to the lounge. You're with our uh, new business partners, I assume. Uh, no, I'm looking for someone named Michelle. Nah, I'm looking for a friend. Michelle. You know her? Come to my room and tell me all about it. Okay, this talk. feels like a trap. You know, I get to hear that a lot. Do you know where she is? Where's Michelle? Upstairs in 208. That all you want? That's yes. I want. <sighs> Wish they were all like you, sweetheart. You treat your mother like this? No, please! Oh, jeez. like when it's doled out to you, do you? I did not see anything. Do something with your life, bro. <laughs> Michelle? <laughs> Oh no, I'm not gonna hurt you. You, Michelle? What's it to you? Fella named Sam is one of your regulars. Maybe there's a lot of guys named Sam. You know him. Works for Don Celieri. Maybe you got him talking about oh. business from time to time, and maybe Don Morello offered you some money to spill what you heard. No, Sam, trust me. I, I don't say nothing. He knows that. Well, the Don's losing a lot of money because someone <laughs> can't keep their mouth shut. I was just bumping. I, I don't think Tommy is going to do it. I didn't mean nothing by it. Oh, and Morello's girls no, told him. I won't never open my mouth again. I know. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. You're scared then. I mean, Sam said you can just make her disappear, Good. not kill her. Don't you ever forget how it feels to be this scared. To know you're just one twitch away from a hole in the ground. Because if you ever show your face in this town again, they're gonna find you with two in the head. Yeah, like the Don said, two understand? in the head. Get out of here. Lucky for you, Sam's got a big heart. Does he, though? Get dressed and make tracks. This place is gonna blow soon. Now we gotta pop a cap in the manager. Thank you. Just don't come back and we're square. We know our Tommy is a big old softy. Let him have it. Oh shoot. I gotta look at my front and my back. Oh, oh. I gotta reload. I gotta pop a cap in these guys. Who wants some more? Oh! Oh! What the hell? I popped a cap here, I popped a cap there. You're running out of bullets? I don't see anyone right now. Shoot! I gotta shoot them! Oh, oh, oh! Got him! What am I gonna do? I'm out of bullets! <laughs> uh, we can talk this up, boys. Uh, about that. Damn it, I should have brought Molotov. Oh, wait. I have a revolver. Oh! Oh, jeez! Oh! Now you're done. There's so many of you! Holy crap! Oh! <laughs> I'm so close to death! Flush him out! Oh! Don't worry, ma'am. No one's gonna hurt you. I'm just going to hurt the guys next to you. Oh shit! Ah! Whoa, okay. So even the glass can hurt me. That's fantastic. We got the cash. Get the heck out of here. Shit. 
Oh, they sniffed out the crime. Damn it. Find a way out of there. Oh, the window. Ugh, it's heavy. I can make it. Oh gosh. Look at the height, man. Just jump. <laughs> Father, son, help me. You have officially bombed a brothel. We have to get out of here. Gunfire and an explosion reported at the Corleone Hotel. Oh, we have to run quickly. Oh. Oh, what the heck? Oh! oh, please don't shoot me. Climb the ladder, climb the ladder, climb the ladder. We have to hurry up. Why am I the one being chased? Oh, yeah. I oh, oh. Oh. Why can't, why can't I shoot you? Oh, it looks like a long jump. Can this man make it across the ladder? Let's find out. Oh! I think that ladder hurt that person. We finally made it to church. Hallelujah. No matter looks how like we made it to the funeral. We can find redemption in death. Redemption. Now, William, he was a sinner, yes. But... He was also a loving son, a protective brother. Your and son. Friend. And for those virtues, we pray that his soul will find salvation. And now I believe one of Billy's closest and dearest friends would like to say a few words. Thank you, Father. Oh, it's this guy. I, uh, I just wanted to pay my respects. The guy who ruined Billy. our coffee time. I never said this, but I consider you my brother. I can't even count all the times you saved my ass from a beat. So I don't know how I'm good. What are you doing? Wait, that's the guy. That's the guy who killed Billy. I think it's too late to do this discreetly. Ah, uh, you are the disgrace to all coffee beans in the country. Let me make a church joke right now. How does Moses like his coffee? He brews them, get it? Too soon? Oh. Oh! Oh! Oh, oh there's more of these guys, huh? Well, that's not a way to treat God's home. No! Hiya! Where are you going, Johnny? You could have stopped all this days ago. Exactly. Wow, it's so dark. And a two and a three. Hey, would you like some of my spaghetti? Oh, don't get away from me, dude. I don't enjoy this as much as you do. Hey, Johnny. Look over here. Hey, we got him. What have you done? Murder in the house of God. You contributed to it, criminals, though. Father. Thieves. Rapists. Killers. And God would have embraced them if they'd asked for forgiveness. Now, which one of these men might have sought redemption by working with the poor? Which one might have saved just one life? None of us, Father. You bastard. If you have any confessions to make, you better do it quick. No more bloodshed, please! So this same guy... 
I'm sorry, Father. Makes Tommy look like the victim. Consider this an act of divine retribution. Oh, geez, Sam. That make us even. Sure. For now. For your trouble, Father. I don't want your blood money. You took theirs. Not a lot of difference from where I'm standing. True. Actually. That should be enough dough to patch up the bullet holes. And keep you quiet. <laughs> when the cops come. You tell them the gunman who did this had East Coast accents. Must have been from out of town. Right? I won't lie. But I won't say anything at all. Good. Zip your lips. Be a shame if we had to and come back And keep a here. secret. Oh! Oh, you startled me. Oh, it's the boys in blue. Sam, what are we going to do? Sam, run. Are you kidding? Hurry up! Oh, you'll never take me alive! Ah! Oh, looks like we stole a cop car. This is getting intense. Bye, boys! Oh! We can't run all the way to Celieri's. Holy crap, look at the amount of cop cars chasing me! Oh no! No! Ah! No, 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 no. Sam, get the heck in the car or I'm leaving you. Let's hide somewhere. Okay. We lost them, finally. Thank Christ. Intermezzo 1938, are we back to this time period? <laughs> Jesus Christ, Tommy. You're confessing to a shootout in a church. And I ain't even through the hard stuff yet. You know I could take you in right now, put your bowling bars, tell you old and gray. Maybe. But I'm desperate, detective. But then you'd never know about Morello. Hey, fellas, sorry to keep you waiting. My shift just started. What you having? Two lunch specials, please. And more coffee. You know what? Let's bring the whole pot. An indication that he's stressed? All right, we more coffee. Together. What kind of heat did you get from the church? It's a strange thing. Nothing really came of it all. Always figured Celieri paid off someone somewhere because it wasn't even in the papers. We just had to lay low for seven, eight months. Oh, that's a long kept time. Went up at the bar just to remind us they were watching. And Frank caught wind that Morello was helping Galati get reelected, hoping he'd go after the Don. Well, I recovered some account books from Morello's offices. Thirty-three was a pretty good year for him. Bastard knew we were bleeding out before we did. While we were busy keeping our heads down, he started moving in on our rackets. Quiet at first, a few trucks go missing. Uh, top burner has one too many highballs, drives off a bridge. Too many highballs. A pickup suddenly closes up shop, moves upstate. You need didn't catch on. Not me. I think maybe Polly smelled something. Ah, uh, Polly. He shoulders, smelled suspicion. Was circling, we were still making good money. And with the Dom worried about keeping the heat off, we didn't have much to do. Except drink, have a few laughs. Oh, so you guys celebrated. Every time I went into Celieri's, that was Sarah. So it was a good year. Until Frank. Who's Frank again? Yeah, that's right. He set me straight. He set us all straight. Oh, the accountant. There's a lot of buzz around town about you guys. Yeah, we got into a little scrap last night. It's no big deal. I don't care about the bar fight, Tom. I care how it looks when you walk into a club and by everyone around. Uh, we gotta do something with that, though. Then blow it at the track on Sunday. Or take a dame to a show. Or invest it, for Christ's sake. <laughs> you want me to become one of those uh. Wall Street boys? <laughs> don't sass me, Tommy. I'm invest to in your you money. So you don't get strangled by them. You ever have a dog, Tom? Sure. A little mutt when I was a kid. Are you guys a when dog person or, or a cat person? Before I came over from the Sicily. 
I had this beautiful, skinny Cherneko de Letna. Like a little greyhound. Aww. Fastest dog you've ever seen. Oh, that's cute. That's how I met the Don. He started setting up races together. Betting on her with coins and rifle shells. There wasn't another dog that could catch her. She never lost. Until the day she did. We were only out of pocket knife, but I never saw the Don so angry. So the she Don has a high temper. No, pregnant. She went into heat, got out of the yard, and every dog in town had a turn. You're like that dog, Tommy. Every time you uh, me around, you're a bitch in heat, and everyone in okay. that club is now looking to fuck you. Man, Frank is fun. roasting me. You're no good to us. Do you understand? Uh, you made your point. Good. Because you need to think about your career here. Look, Paulie's at his ceiling. He's the guy we want in a tussle, but he's not smart enough to run anything. Sam is loyal, but he has no vision. But you, Tommy. You could run this town someday. He could see potential in him. Well, I appreciate that, Frank. Frank is a good guy. So, uh, what happened to the dog? The Don tried to drown her. Huh? I broke his nose. Oh, this just got sad. You can let me off here. Pot of coffee? Give Sarah my best, Tommy. Good talk, Frank. Back then, everything went through Frank. The plans, the orders, the money. You could get the call day or night. Oh, so things must have been good. Ah, Tom. They're bustling. Frank says to wait for him in the garage out in the back, eh? You got the job, I think. Ooh, looking good with that coat there, Tommy. Where's Frank? 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 Oh, there he is. Thanks for waiting, What's Tom. going on the here? The Don and I had to go over last month's numbers again. Sure. So what's the job? I want you to help Sam and Polly with the shipment we've got coming in tonight. It's what kind of shipment? Straight from Canada. Where do you need me? Oh, I see the good the north, stuff the came from Canada. Polly will oversee the trucks bringing the shipment into the city, but I want you to go with him. Be an extra pair of eyes. Make sure it all goes smoothly. Okay. You Get can rely on me. Meet Polly at the warehouse. He's got heaters in case you run into any trouble. Sure, Frank. No problem. Good. Now bring the Canadian home safe, Tommy. <laughs> there is already a case you're marked for the Don. Bring the Canadian home safe. Get out of here, filthy punk. Vincenzo? Eh, hey, that's mean. Come on, Tom! I got it, Polly, I got it. Hey, hey! Watch it, pal! Just dry it out! Come on, brother! Give me a hug! Know this place? Uh, yeah. <laughs> We've done a few pickups at the farm before. Don't worry. There ain't nothing but cow shit and shine out here. I want to worry about that. Clams. Boys will load up the trucks, and we'll come straight back. You know, we'll come back quick. alive. We've got some place to be. Ah, uh, you see it, Sarah, later. Luigi's little girl, your night shift. <laughs> You're something else, pal. Protecting the girl's virginity one day and taking it the next. Lay off, Polly. Ah, oh, come on. I'm just kidding. She's a good girl. You settle down, she'll straighten you right out. Appreciate that, Polly. You're going home to a couch. <laughs> Oh, okay, this is sad. I wonder what kind of stories she could tell about her old man, though. 
Luigi was a stone cold killer back in the day. Guys, we figured out Luigi's dark know. secret. You know she's been helping out behind the bar since she was a kid. I bet she's seen and heard a few things. Probably knows more about our business than we do. That's she why it's better not, not to, to mess with me Sarah. Questions. That's good. She won't ever make a liar out of you. Christ. You ought to marry her just for that. Polly might just be a psychic. God damn it. Sam should be waiting here, but I don't see him. Something's What's going on? Off. Don't let your Pekka get all shriveled up. Probably just trying to get out of the rain. Or into the bootleg. <laughs> That'll wake him. Something coming. doesn't sound right. Okay. Let's go find him. Yeah, that Sam's bastard. not drunk. It's just three sheets, and I'm wrecking a new suit for nothing. I swear I'm gonna kill him. Here. Just in case Frank was right. Okay. I'm gonna go I really feel like we're going to be ambushed, though. Out. You go ahead, see what's what. We'll catch up with you. Got it. Hey, buddy. Oh, the driver is dead. Jesus. Drop. Your weapon. You first. Oh, I knew it was an ambush. Sorry, pal. Guess we're doing this the hard way. Wait, weren't you the guy okay, that then. shot Polly? Get over here! I got him pinned down! Oh, not so fast. Hey, over here! Over here! Holy crap! There's so many of them! Nice try! Holy crap, no! Huh, oh, you wanna dance? Where? You ambushed the wrong man. Now what do we got here? Oh! It's me, Tom! Polly! What took you so long? Looking for Sammy. Did you find him? Nah, not yet. Where is Sammy? Just him. <laughs> Canadian crew. Dollars to donuts to rest the face down in the dirt, too. <sighs> oh no, they were attacked by Canadians. Oh Christ. Why? They're cops, Tommy. Huh? Well, how would I know? They didn't show a badge. God, they didn't say anything. They must be in Morello's pocket. This bastard. He can't even let us have this one racket. This Morello is one huge threat. Forget about it, Tom. We gotta find Sam and get out of here. Yeah, we are already in so much doo-doo. They didn't indicate they were Border Patrol police. Tommy! You don't want to see this! Jesus. What? Oh, that's what you wanted me to see? Each day, a Canadian is in danger in Mafia Definitive Edition. It's not like, um, someone is hiding there. Ah! You're done for! Oh! Who wants some more? Sam? Oh, no! That was by accident! No, I wasted a Molotov. Over here. Right, go, go. Do you know there were a bunch of you guys there? Get ready, guys. Yeah, go. Cool. Yeah, oh, Sam's fending them up. Oh, Sam, Sam. 
Oh, that was close. Need a molly? Yep, I knew you needed one. Yeah, I'm not letting you do that again. We gotta save him from bleeding out. You boys stay here and watch our backs. Plug anyone who gets within a hundred yards. Plug anyone who gets within a hundred yards. Is someone in there? Sammy, oh, Jesus, what have they done to you? Oh, that's a lot of blood. Grace, that's a lot of blood. Can you walk? It doesn't feel good to get clipped. No, I don't think so. Okay, okay, okay. Hang on. I'll go get the truck, then we'll take you to the doctor. Hey, hey, you gonna make it, Sam? Tommy, hmm. stay here with him. I'll be back. I'll be back in a flash. Okay. Deep breaths. Whew. One, two. Hey, hey, it'll be okay, Sam. We survived worse. Sure. Sure we are. Yeah, it must have been like hell though. Oh, someone's been shooting them. Who's taking cover? Yes. Not to fear, Tommy Angelo is here. Ooh. I love this. Oh, I'll finish him. Oh, god dang it. Oh crap! We need to defend them. Hey, attention on me! Eyes on me, brothers! Perfect time to use my shotgun! Oh! Oh, what the hell? Since I can't reach you. Fire in the hole. Count me out, count. I'm hurting over here. Oh gosh, is Sam okay? Jesus, this hurts. Jesus Christ. Ugh. Where's the goddamn truck? We need to get some medical attention. Crap, we got cops. Cops too? God, the boys in blue don't give up. Time to defend Sam again. Just a little longer. Who's a sitting duck? What are you talking about? Oh. Ooh, Wally, we... I just switched my gun. This is getting so intense. How long am I going to have to do this? Oh. Oh, head butted. Yeah. Okay. Looks like we saved them enough time. Looks like rescue is on their way. Oh Christ. Tony and Donnie too? Yeah. What a fucking massacre. How's Sam? Well, he ain't any worse. I'll go get him. Keep an eye out. 
Yeah! I knew that was a good plan. Sam and Polly, reliable friends of Tommy. It's okay, deep breaths. <laughs> you guys are going to just shove him to the back of the truck. Ew. Get in. Okay, okay. Hey, we're gonna get y'all patched up. We're gonna get you patched up, don't worry. Oh, I'm driving them out of here. Who's that? Morello's boys? We got more company. Alright, get in. Okay, that doesn't look good. I'm right here, Sam. There's some ammo and a Thompson back there somewhere. Can't I use a shotgun? Oh wait, they might be long distance. I got it. Also, we'll be doing some sniping. The boys in blue won't know what hit him. I wonder. Oh, shoot the drivers. We have unlimited ammo, folks, so we shouldn't worry. No. Oh. Jeez. One down. One to go. We're in trouble, Tom. Yeah, we're in huge trouble, Tom. Woo! The boys in blue, I almost got him. Oh, Get ow. Polly faster. Polly faster. To the metal. Did we lose him? I don't think so. Two squad cars on us. These guys keep on coming. They're not giving up, are they? The boys in blue. They're right on our ass. I know. Just in time for my new Tommy. Tommy shooting with a Tommy. Oh. From the side. Oh crap. What the hell? What the hell? I can't even see that car. Oh. Yeah, he's gone. Yeah, he's gone. Uh, we're going to crash. Which side will it tip off? Now we'll know who has a little more weight by how the truck tips. Gosh. Why? Oh, this has got to be a glitch. Are you guys secretly wizards? You're a blue boy. Harry. Polly, we need to go now. Oh, ow. This is a problem. Polly, you're not doing any work. Oh. We're gonna crash! Yeah! Looks like Polly's got some driving skills. Oh shit! A tank? What the? Why is there a tank? 
Ow, ow, ow. I know. Oh, I shot him. I thought the turret was gone. The wing shield armor. Oh, I see it. I see it. Time to take off some wing shield armor. The boys in blue are feeling vulnerable today. Ooh, some mollies. Yeah! We got more of where that came from. Oh! Holy, we gotta lose him. Whoa, look at that explosion. Oh! We did it! We did it! We did it! Oh, Sam looks like he's about to pass up. Okay, we're here. Tell him. You get Sam out. I'm gonna go wake up the doc. Sam. Sam. We made it. We're at the doctor's house. Oh, he bled too much. Three, I owe you. Come on, push it together. Where's the doctor? Oh, what the hell are you doing here so late? Uh, uh, evening, Doc. Sorry to wake you, but um, we had a little accident. We got an injured man out here. All right, bring him inside. Okay, thank you. Yes! Okay, uh, I'll stay with Sam. You can take the truck back. Call it a night. No, I'll wait. <laughs> Oh, uh, Tommy wanted to look after Sam. No sense of both of us breathing down his neck. Go on, Tom. I'm gonna be fine. Okay. Hey. You did good tonight. You did good tonight, too. We brought the truck back. The Canadian beer is ours. You're late. Dinner's cold. Oh, she saw the blood. I guess even she knows the darkest parts of being in that mafia. I get your message. Sit What's down, up, Don? We have a mole, Tom. A mole? No. Who? Oh. I was up all night driving myself nuts trying to figure it out. 
started thinking maybe it's one of our guys. We aren't paying his fair share. Someone with a light wallet. Maybe looking to Morello for a new suit. Frank wasn't around, so I went to the safe to get the account books to see who's getting cents on the dollar he's earned. What do you know? What's happening? The books are gone, Tom. The money? Frank. We have a mall. <sighs> More than 50 years I've known him. <sighs> Everything I have, I got with Frank. But why? Okay, we stopped him. So those people were cops. Why are they covering him? How are we going to get inside? Maybe an open back door? We have to get the heck out of here. Ah! Frank! How could you? Ow, ow! Get in hangar! <laughs> that was a close one. Tom, Look at the shotgun. The Don sent me. I figured as much. I'm sorry it had to be you, Tommy. Oh. Anything you want me to tell him? I wish it could have shaken out better, but Morello finally came after me. It's okay. You can come out. Morello? Oh, it's his wife and daughter. Morello offered me a simple trade. The Don's account books for our lives and tickets out of this town. So Morello's turning the, the Don's men yet. against him. I'm not so stupid, Don. They're safe. Morello is waiting for this. It's a key to a box in the Grand Imperial Bank downtown. I told Morello I'd hand it over after the plane was fueled and ready to go. His men were meant to fetch it before we left. I see. I took care of them. Tell them to get on a plane. Go on march, Alice. Get the boy. Oh, uh, I didn't Frank, actually take care of us. the men. Not right now, honey. Just get buckled in. Tommy and I, we have some serious business to discuss. But Frank, oh, so the Frank march. wants to stick with us. For Alice. For me. Get on the goddamn plane, please. Frank is a good guy. MVP. You been paid yet? Yeah. Now you've been paid twice. You take the ladies wherever they want to go. Yes, sir. Thank you, Tom. Christ, Frank. Why didn't you ask us for help? Yeah, you could have. I guess I just wanted out. One way or the other. I'm tired, Tommy. Tired of lying to my wife. Tired of checking oh. out of my car every time I take a Sunday drive. And tired of waiting for the dawn to put two in my temple. Oh, so maybe Tommy is going through the same thing in the future. God damn you, Frank. Both may not be good men, but they have hearts of gold. We will continue Mafia Definitive Edition in the next episode. That is all for today. 
If you enjoyed this video, please make sure to subscribe, like the video, and share the video. Especially if you want another part of Mafia Definitive Edition. Thank you for watching, and that's all.